Welcome to the BDHD check system for testing surfaces for hazardous drug contamination. Let's begin by collecting all of our materials for a test. For each surface to be tested, you'll need to gather one collection kit pouch, one of each drug assay cartridge to be tested, one template if using one, and the analyzer for processing results. It is advised to also have a timer to track test runtime. The BDHD check system is non sterile. Disinfect all packaging before entering any sterile area per your facility's policies. Let's begin. For each sample area, you'll need a new pair of gloves to avoid cross contamination. For each area you'd like to test, we recommend using the BDHD check template if possible. The template has a self-adhesive backing that will keep it from moving during sample collection. The interior space of the template is one square foot. If not using a template, it is recommended the area is approximately one square foot. Now to begin our sample collection. Tear open the collection kit pouch to find the transfer vial and another pouch containing the pre-moistened swab. At the location of sample collection, tear open the swab packaging and remove the swab by its handle. Beginning at a corner, press firmly while wiping the sample area. You should move slowly with each wipe. We recommend counting to three for each wiping stroke. Be sure to wipe the entire area from orange edge to orange edge. You may notice when the wiping solution dries, it may leave a residue. This should be cleaned and disinfected per your facility's procedures. While holding the vial upright, open the transfer vial's cap. Once you've inserted the swab, reapply the cap. Be sure to close firmly for a good seal. When complete, we need to extract our samples, so fully invert the transfer vial for a minimum of five full cycles. One cycle is a complete motion to invert and back. Once the sample has been collected and extracted, we can begin our test. Open all drug assay cartridges. To transfer the sample, remove the small yellow cap from the vial and hold upright over the sample well. This is the smaller opening on the assay cartridge. Squeeze the transfer vial to dispense four drops into each cartridge. Reapply the yellow cap once complete. After you've dispensed your first sample into the assay cartridge, begin timing your sample runtime for five minutes. Note, timers are not included with the system. Turn the analyzer on. When it reads Insert Test Device, you're ready to insert your first assay cartridge. Wait until the five minutes expires and insert the cartridge face up into the slot on the analyzer's right side. The analyzer will automatically begin the test, counting down to a result. This will only take a few seconds per test. Once complete, the analyzer will provide the drug name and a plus sign if the result is positive or a minus sign if the result is negative. Before removing the cartridge, record the test results. You can now remove the assay cartridge and insert the next in line when its sample process time is complete. Dispose of all supplies, including drug assay cartridges, according to your facility's procedures. Clean and decontaminate the analyzer and return to its power source. Congratulations! Your testing is complete.